ஆர்மமெண்டேரியம் ரெக்வயர்டு மெக்கன் ட்ராக் ஷீட் க்ரீன் கிளாத் க்ளவுஸ் மெட்டல் ஸ்கேல் லெக்ரான் கார்வர் வேக்ஸ் பிளாக் பாலிஷிங் கிளாத் டேக் அ வேக்ஸ் பிளாக் அண்ட் மார்க் அ சென்ட்ரல் லைன் ஆன் ஆல் தி ஃபோர் சர்ஃபேசஸ் ஜாயின் தோஸ் லைன்ஸ் ஆன் போத் அப்பர் அண்ட் லோயர் சர்ஃபேஸ் ஆஃப் வேக்ஸ் பிளாக் Divide the crown into 3 parts. 8.5 mm for crown. 14 mm for root. And rest for base. Draw horizontal line dividing crown, root and base. Similarly draw on all sides. Mark one side as buckle. Opposite to that is parallel. And other two sides are mesial. and distal divide the crown into three equal parts incisal middle and cervical draw two equal horizontal lines similarly draw line on all sides on mesial and distal side draw a slanting line on the incisal third of the crown for reduction of parietal cut reduce the wax outside the marking on buckle aspect draw a pentagon of mesio distal diameter at cervix 5 mm and middle third 7 mm Mesial slope is larger when compared to distal slope. Reduce the wax outside the marking. Buckle surface of the tooth which runs cervico-occlusally approximately in the center of the crown. To make a buckle ridge, reduce the wax on either side of the midline. Similarly, make a palatal ridge on palatal aspect of the crown. Occlusal surface is divided by a central developmental groove. Buccal triangular ridge. Mesial and distal cuspal incline of buccal cusp join to form buccal triangular ridge which extends from cusp tip to central groove. To make a buccal triangular ridge, remove the wax on one side of the midline in a oblique direction from the cusp tip 
to margin of triangular fossa and do the same on other side of midline so that we can get a buccal cuspal structure is repeated to form palatal cusp triangular fossa is a depression seen on the either side of the marginal ridge remove little bit of wax on the meso buccal incline and meso palatal incline to create a margin of a mesial triangular fossa similarly reduce the wax on distal buccal incline and distal palatal incline to create a margin of distal triangular fossa remove little bit of wax on the triangular fossa without breaking the marginal ridge root carving draw a conical root form on both buccal and parallel aspect After cutting the base, root tend is rounded. Mesial marginal developmental groove extending from central groove of occlusal surface crosses the mesial marginal ridge to reach mesial surface of crown. Mark cervical line on all sides. The curvature is towards root tip on both buccal and palatal sides and towards occlusal surface on mesial side. and almost straight on distal side this is the final look of the maxillary first premolar